Welcome back to Subsistence this is Game Edge, and yes, we've done quite a bit. We've got ourselves our new gun. Just reload it for no apparent reason. That's that's the stuff. That is the stuff we're talking about. Oh boy, so much fun! I am having a blast. We still have four spawns here. Well, we have way too much. We have so much power going through it now. We're doing extremely well. This base is solid. We have a lot to do, rails and stuff. We still have to go out and get a bunch of stuff. Um, I, I want to check out to see if the feces is out and about. Oh, oh, look at that. Fang left us a present. That's nice of him. Fang is our rabbit over here. Good job, brother. Good job. And you got some poop. Even better. You can live another day. Let's see here. Pick up another water. He's doing fine. He's alive and kicking. And harvest time. All right, great. So we'll harvest up all of our cotton here. We should probably plant some more. It is going through quite fast. More than I ever thought I would ever go through. So with cotton here, you can actually just go over here in this tab and go down to cotton. It's over here and you get cloth. Bam, 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 bam. Just, just do it all the way. Just get it all in there. Uh, we're actually going to go inside and get ourselves a little more cotton. And that is going to be much needed. We have tons of seeds. We can only do eight at a time. These are the cotton seeds. These are tomatoes. We will probably have to do a stack of tomatoes sooner or later. We are kind of hungry. We'll take a little shot of that. And make our way back into here and drop off all eight. You have to drop these in one at a time. Just like you would for planting. Shift click doesn't work, so it's okay. Whoops. I canceled it. Wow, I didn't know you can cancel it. Interesting. I wonder if I get back what I... No, I do not. When you cancel out, you do not get it back. God darn it. That's a shame. That's a shame. That was just an extra click for no apparent reason. But it's okay. It's just a seed. We will get more of these. We will get more. We will go hunting about to see what we got. Uh, there are rogues out and about. There's hunters that can kill us if you're brand new to this game. This is made by a sole developer called Cold Games. And this game has been playing for almost 15 months, if not more. Not exactly sure. Last February. I think it is. Last February. Anyways, it has been a long time and a lot of videos and hang a lot of fun with it and it keeps on getting better. Actually, we should actually put the manure in here. Unless it's full. It is full. I did fill it up. We actually just take it and drop the fertilizer in here for manure. We can actually make ourselves another crate out here. Maybe it would be nice. So we could drop off those kind of things in here. We don't have to keep that. Actually, shoot. we'll do that right away, actually. Uh, we'll go to bench over here, though. I do want to make some more gunpowder. Since with the 44... It's costing us a fortune. We're going to make as many as we possibly can with what we have. And yeah, we're out of potassium. That's, that's not good. We're going to need more of that. All right, let's get it going. Let's just drop this off. We'll let this go. And we're going to need some nails over here. Grab some nails and make ourselves a crate. Now, the crate itself is pretty easy to do. It's nice and simplistic. You know, you could do, pick it up. Bam. You just got to need some cordage to free them. Let's do one, two, three. And we got way more cordage. So right now I'm making only with... Well, I didn't want to, really want to make more cordage. But as we're going through this, we're going to be making no less cordage now. And actually making more of the actual other stuff. Which is going to be... Well, we're actually going to be making a lot more logs for the fire. That's all we need. See, look. It's right there. Rabbit's right there. Just in case something will give an ask if he's still alive. He's alive. He's doing fine. He's, uh, he's breathing. <laughs> Let's craft this storage crate up here. We'll drop you off here. We'll do a split one, so with a drop care, perfect. And we're gonna drop you off here for now. We're gonna make a manure crate out there and maybe drop off some water and other things in there. There we go, we have so much of it that it makes no difference. Uh, we could use a drink, actually. Be nice and perfect. Just split these out open here. Oh. That's a bugged one. Okay, well, we'll leave it there for now. It is a brand new update. He did do a massive update on it, so it could cause some errors and all that. And it's perfect. This is going to have to skew up. What we do is we're turning you off for now. And then we're going to go back and do the same thing for the cotton right afterwards. Just make that crate really quick. But do not, you're not going to lose any of the stuff you built unless it's starting to craft, as we saw. So that is not a big problem at all. Uh, we're going to make some cloth right here. Now, if you're wondering what paddock cloth is for, it's for clothing. Uh, you can make it too. You can use cotton regular actual cloth and that's how you make her clothes if you're not too sure go and check out the early versions of this game where i actually did all this work and got ourselves here we will be restarting sooner or later uh but again there's always so much fun with this new gun i don't want to lose it all right we're gonna drop off a few some water some water over here so and we'll split make a nice row out here oops i didn't want to drink it we'll split one and we'll do a manure trail over here too. It's gonna pile up pretty fast, so we're just gonna make sure we have enough room 
for everything. Everything's gonna be nice in place here. We'll bring the seeds here afterwards. And uh, this is actually going right now. And we actually need to upgrade this to get power efficiency on it. That is something we're gonna work on. We need iron. We need a little more iron. That's our, our downfall in this game right now. We're having a lot of problems with that to get more of it, but it's okay. All right, we'll drop off what we can with cloth here. And uh, we'll keep the extra bullet. It makes no difference at this point. Probably end up using it. And our bow, we can actually drop off back into our slot. All right, I actually made some uh, bow, some arrows here. We got plenty of them. We're doing pretty good. You know, I'm just feeling like making sure I put that now. That way, we're not going to have problems with it. You know, it'd be nice to have everything all stockpiled here and knowing where everything's at. Uh, tomatoes, we have plenty. We could make another planter. That would be nice. We could turn on a light too for nighttime on it to grow a lamp. And uh, we're not going to be doing that right now. All right, so right now we got the potassium going. We also have some uh, iron and this will turn off by itself so we're not worried we have enough power running this we're running for ash we need that for gunpowder so that is great uh is there enough room in that slot there to do what i'm doing here there was all right, 120 we got out of that beautiful all part of getting yourself ready for the game you have to get yourself ready all the time we have tons of bullets enough to protect ourselves oh man look at the bottom of that thing it's all broken okay always something to do it's a big base it's not small it's huge all right so let's go and fix that right away before they destroy it and then it'll cost us even more materials let's just bring ourselves over here oops open up and we're gonna crawl down here and hit this up you'll see right now it's the bar going up green and repairing it's taking up right now some logs for repairs and we'll just repair all this baby up here and make sure she's all proven proper now, if it was metal itself, we'd have to need planks themselves, but we don't need that right now. Wow, they really damaged a lot of this. Thank God I went logging for an entire day. After we logged off on the live stream, I went out and did some logging. So, okay, I won't be able to do that because I don't have that. All right, well, we're going to have to come back and fix all this. That is a shame. All right, how are the stairs doing? Stairs are perfectly fine. How did he get underneath here and not affect the stairs? This one was literally one gunshot away from death. <laughs> we would have to redone it. I prefer to have this all clean. Probably one more here. A little bit damage here. Now, this is part of your daily kind of thing. You have to kind of get yourself ready. Maybe not every day, but as much as you possibly can. Get yourself ready, prim and proper. Make sure your walls are safe. Again, if you have a smaller base, you'll have less worries because it'll be easier for you to control. That is for sure. All right, let's get this back in here. We'll put our hammer back because there's no need for it when we're going out. We want to keep as much room for our loot. I don't have enough right now for getting us some iron uh, so we just won't be able to make a lock pick not enough iron it's all good we're fine all right we're ready to go we are ready to go let's see what the oh, this is leading us up here this is nice got some fiber right here and we got ourselves some uh, wow he really did change the fiber the way it looks <laughs> it really stands out now it used to be so hard to find the same color the grass and now it's like easy to find I mean, I preferred it when it was hard because I went through the hard part of it, but I understand a lot of people had a problem with it. It's all good. It's understandable. There's a crate over here. Follow the fiber, man. Follow the fiber. Always bring you some goodness. Uh, that's zinc, and that's potassium. Potassium I do need. We will take you back here for right now. Probably won't use the axe for a little bit unless we're running out of space now and bring all my guns with me. Now, the six-shooter 44, I'm not going to be doing anything with her at the current state. I will probably upgrade a little more as we go through it. She's already upgraded two tiers, so we want to upgrade her a little more just to give her a little oomph. It is a beautiful gun. I'm telling you now, it's, it's stunning. It is the most powerful weapon in the game. You do have to shoot about two notches lower. I know I said it in the live stream, but in case you missed it, you have to shoot about two notches lower than the SVT. Just a tiny bit. And we want to avoid any kind of conflict right now. Well, not with the wolf. Whoa, whoa, tree, tree. <laughs> oh, bear. Yeah, I thought so. Just couldn't leave alone, eh? Whoa. What was that about? I was jammed into this ground. Well, when I did that spin, somehow I couldn't turn myself around all the way. Oh, well. So be it sit here and whine about it it won't help anything let's get ourselves back out here again this is early access this game is brand spanking new being built every day there's always something new 
that Cold Games is putting in almost weekly, if not bi-weekly, and uh, he's working hard, and I can only tell you from the community, if you joined us, you'll see there's tons of us who are in love with this game, and it's because we've followed how the game should be ran and played it, and it is enjoyable as hell. So if you're brand new to this, you check it out. Also check us out on Discord, you'll see a lot of subsistence fanatics there, and there is a lot of chat rooms and stuff in there you can get involved in it and talk to. No links for that is in the description. Feel sorry in the front page. I was just looking of the YouTube channel too. So be careful. We are pretty close. He could come and attack. They're all the way back there. Okay. I don't need anything but rabbits. You didn't see your buddy go down. No, he didn't. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You didn't see anything. He was even squeaking and he didn't look. All right. We'll get some cloth really quick. You can actually bring these back if you want to, directly to your uh, to your housing. And if you want to, you have a little bit of time uh, if they're alive and kicking. Unfortunately, those ones uh, died. I need cloth. Big time. So we will do what we have to do to get the cloth right now. We will mix berries up together here. Make sure we get our nutrition up here. So this will give us more nutrition. It gives us a total with bottled water here, which is berry water. And it gives you a total of 15 fruits and vegetables, 5 hunger, and 34 hydration. A lot more than just plain old berry water or splitting them up and eating one on each side. Eating one berry and eating and having, sorry, drinking some water. Much, much better. You. Take you. Yeah, we got some. Uh, I got a rabbit right here too. I kind of want him badly, badly, badly. Okay, hopefully he won't annoy us. We need that too, big time. Okay, we're still in a crate really close. They are there. That's cool. All right, that's good. That was good. Woohoo! Talk about picking up some good loot. All right, we're gonna take this roundabout over here in the back end. We're gonna see if there's anything new because it seems like this is where it's leading me to. And also see if there's any rogues around this area. And we're gonna mine a little more. Now you can mine them if you had to with the axe, you'll get less back with it. So of course, taking out your pickaxe is the best. Right now I have too many guns with me, to tell you the truth, but I can't help it. I like switching up. Might be bears around here. Should we load this baby up? Make sure she's loaded and ready to go. Alright, that's good. Some more SVT. I would like to see some 44, but I haven't seen... I don't think I've seen any 44 except for inside the hunter's base. I guess with the value of how expensive it is, you probably won't see it in these crates. It would be nice. It would be nice to get a little bit. We got some more cotton seed. That's nice. It makes up for the one we lost. There is a wolf. Like I said, they're all over the place. Kind of annoying. I'm also looking for iron. I'm going a different way. This place I don't really go to very often. But it's needed sometimes to go out and check out different areas and see if there's any more loot or if there's good spawn points. Currently, that's what it's doing. Uh, crates will kind of spawn in throughout the game. So prepare yourself. I mean, you'll just have to pick them up. Uh, as the game progresses, I don't know if that will continue or not. I think his end point is not to have as many crates spawning as you'd have to pick up all these things uh, throughout the game. Now, the map is supposed to expand in a future date. We're not sure exactly when. I'm not seeing anything over here. This is not a good area. We're not seeing fiber or anything. Stay away from it. He's already expanded the map once. The map is quite huge. And if you don't know it, like I always tell people, if you start this game off first time ever, you want to go easy mode, no hunters, then progress. Go up slowly. You'll enjoy it a lot more. Trust me. You'll get to know the map, get to know the areas, rocks, certain things that you need. That is your best bet. Oh, that's a bunny rabbit. 
Uh, I missed him. I wasn't sure where he was exactly, but it's okay. Stuck on a tree. We'll pick it back up. I don't know where he went. Now, this is a dangerous area as hell, so we'll be careful. Wolves, bears, ninja bears, whatever you can think of. They're out there. Now, we can actually cut down trees to see they right to the right. I saw him before, but now he might chase. Get him on a run. Get him on a run. That's good. Double check my backside, make sure everything's okay. There is two more hunter bases to our left side here, and they can go pretty far out. So watch yourself. Getting too close. Unless you want to start a fight now. Right now, we've attacked them so many times that they haven't really had time to give you enough loot back. It takes about three to five days total. If they constantly attack and do what they're doing, I don't see their stuff. Oh, there it is. Now, the, the ones over here, the pale wood. That is ours. Those are four bases to ignore the crap out of them. Uh, they're heavily damaged. I do believe the guys attack on those bases for no apparent reason. Because the damage is on them. It's, it's incredible. I've never seen so much damage. And I constantly repair them. So four bases were fun. But uh, it's more fun just to attack and not have to worry about those. Ends up being more of a chore. That's a chicken. I don't want chickens. A fiber or a rabbit? Because there's fiber over here. That might be something leading it to us. Uh, I can see the right hand side all the way to the right. I see a road going up for logs. I don't know if you guys can see it there, but he's right down there somewhere. I saw him go past the trees. So he's out and about right around that location. I told you that we have to be careful. <laughs> Is that a rabbit or a chicken? I think it's a chicken. I won't tell until I get near it. Yeah, it's a chicken. Oop, wolf. Okay, I need this badly. Hopefully none of them will attack. I'm getting ready to flip over if I have to. Or we got a bear somewhere else. Maybe on the right hand side of this rock. Yeah, he's right here. Black bear. My opinion, they're, they are very aggro. They're very, very aggro, those bears. You have to be very careful of them. They will attack, but again, Cole Games had told us that there's really not much difference between both, except, well, there's some coding differences. He's not sure if they would actually be different, but from my honest opinion, yes, it seems like it. Again, perception is always different than what actually is. All right, I don't come around here very often. It's actually another great place to build a base. Kind of dangerous as hell, but beautiful. Especially that rock. Ooh, nice. Where are we? Come on, give me some more loot. loot. I'm getting a little quiet. Sorry, as soon as I see that wolf, I'm, I, I automatically in my head, I'm going, get quiet. Alright, some more stuff. That's good, because I'm starting to get worried that we got into a bad loot run. Now up here, been very lucky lately. We've found like five, six loot crates in one shot. It's a lot of work to get around it. I'm not seeing anything here. That's a good tree to knock out. If you can, hit that up. You get six logs. I know I say it every single time, but it is my lucky tree. These are my lucky trees. There's a whole bunch of them over the map. I think about five or six of them, I think, total. All right. Some more scrap. Where's that wolf? Oh, he's there. We'll go ahead up to the tree up on a hill then instead. Just because I don't feel like getting killed. Is that copper again? I think that's copper. I really don't need it, but... Oh, we got... We got some rogues. And we're inside their, their thing. I'm going to hear them. Yeah, it's right there. Whoa! He's going to shoot. <laughs> Shit! Being shot from multiple sides. Uh, 
Jesus. I can't really see him. Damn it. Stop moving. Let me shot from everywhere. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, right in the head. The headshot, too. Son of a bitch. You can growl all you want. You see what I have to deal with? There's more. Shit. Why is that wolf not attacking him? God damn it. Oh my god, I missed him. Damn it, he swerved so fast. Okay, that's enough now. Wow, I've used so much medical right now. There we go. That was all over the place and upside down and sideways and then Tuesday on the side. Holy effing Christ. One, two, three, four. I think it's four rogues. One, two, three. I think there's another one on top of the hill here. Pretty sure I took one out up here, didn't I? Did I not? Or they were just that well organized, they were surrounding me all the time. I might have lost one crate. Wow, I got my R's handed it to me there. Gonna happen, so be it. Lick your wounds sometimes. Just lick your wounds. I think I really get used to a six shooter. I know it's powerful. It just needs a little more oomph to it. <sighs> wow. That was special. Just let me cut open. Come on. So use the axe to open this up. That was a little bit crazy. Crazy. Crazy that was. All right, take all... Eat you up. Get back some energy. Making room at the same time. Here you go. Water right here, just like I showed you before. No fruit vegetables, 39, 29 hydration. And this goes up to with 34 hydration. You see that? It's pretty damn good. Much more worthwhile than anything else you could find here. All right, we're good to go here. Oh, really? Benarama, death to you. That's for not doing your job either. You should have attacked them. Now, they usually do attack the hunters and the rogues. But unfortunately, sometimes they do not. And this time they did not. I don't know if I'm missing a crate here. It's kind of pissing me off. Feels like I am. Oh, wow. Okay, some iron here. Let's get us over here. Let's knock this baby open. Again, iron, iron, iron. Get it, get it as much as you possibly can. Now, you might have a game with... You don't have a problem with iron. I do. I have a mega problem with iron and potassium. Uh, they are very hard to find. For some reason, potassium all of a sudden in this save, I could find a little more than I thought. Maybe I just use it more than I thought. But iron is arduous. That's iron, okay. There's some potassium here. That's for sure. That's really white. Oh, uh, that's why I was having a problem. It was in between the the respawn. Now everything has respawned itself. So that's a shame. Is that a cradle way up there? I think so. Alright, let's go and see where their base was. Well, that was wild. Where was her base anyways? Oh, there it is. That's why. I thought they were over there on the left, but ended up being on the right. Well, on the left here. It was I thought they were on the right here. It is what it is. We'll get ourselves up on that crate over here. Jump, jump, jump. Oh yes, a building crate too. I love it. Ugh. 
Not when it's crap like that, though. Oh, nothing came in over there. I was double checking our backside. Whoa, watch out, Game Edge. You could have hurt yourself. Don't want to break a leg now. All right, well, we didn't die. So let's take that. We didn't die. It could have been another way, but I used a crap load of resources, which that's what irritates me the most right now. I've used more resources than I want to. Five, six, seven. I'd like to have ten on me. Ten of each. It is a shame. Especially I'm finding medical plants are harder to find, or I'm seeing less of them in my load here. So I'm starting to run low. Then again, I am killing like crazy. And pretty much daily. And the anger meter is pretty high up on these guys. There's one that's more valuable than anything else right now. That nor. Checking our right side. There's our massive base. It is a compound. A big fort. Whichever one you want to call it. It is mammoth. And it's done us well. This game has given it and taken it from us. And yeah. It's taken a lot. <laughs> it's taken a lot of us. We've been in this game for over 100 days. If not more. Way more than that probably. I should have to check for this next game. Let's get some more iron. A little bit of foobar day, but it's okay. It's okay. Live and learn. I got caught off guard. You also have to be prepared. This game is early access and has tons of work to be done. And there's other things. Uh, maybe the, hopefully, uh, the way the AI react. I don't like the way they hide behind bushes and they can shoot me without any problems. Uh, if I'm hiding somewhere, those are kind of harder things to swallow but we have to get used to it we have to have patience and realize this is a developer who's worked extremely hard and done extremely well with this game and only have tons of respect for him yeah we played it all us up last game on the stream we used all our plating we could just double check and see perimeter if there's anything else nope all right well the front of the base needs some kind of uplift here i don't like this part well, it's like the back door, I guess. We'll turn on a light here. We do have our fall lights for outside, which, uh, as you can hear, but they drain a crap load. I mean, a crap load of, of energy. Uh, before that goes out, I'm just going to grab one of you. And go back, go back. Fuel into it. Beautiful. We'll cook up one liver that we have. We'll render our fat, which gives us biofuel, which we need. That is phenomenal. That'll get going. Cook the food. Perfect, perfect. And the rest is good to go. All right. We also had our refinery going a full throttle. We still have 2,965 power at 4,124 mass. It doesn't go down when I'm using this, but definitely good to double check. There we go. Get some iron and potassium rolling yet again. We want to get as much as we can of those. We can drop these in here as storage. There we go. Perfect. All right. So we have 12 of you. Some more ash. That's perfect. Some more potassium in there. And we're going to go check our plants anyways outside. We have nails. Gun. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. Here's a little darker, so I'm just going to grab this. Should put a light out here. Eh? Really kind of needs it. We'll turn on our grow light here to make sure that it grows for the night. And we'll grab our manure we had over here. And fertilize it. Pretty much it took almost everything. Wow. Kind of surprised. All right, we'll get some water too. We have some here. Let's see, but probably got to get four. Ah, two. Perfect. That filled it up. And the steaks are cooking. Yes, they are cooking. And how are you doing there, buddy? I'll give you some berry water. There you go. Move yourself up. We'll grab a couple more of this water here. We got three more extracted from our well. That is a phenomenal. Our steak is, our liver is ready to go. We'll eat that. And it's going to bring up our hunger over here. That's perfect. This is going. And what's left here? I need to, to pick up the manure in here. That's what I came here for. 27 manure. Let's make sure fertilizer is up to par. Perfect. Now that's all nice. It'll grow overnight. And once it's done, we'll be able to harvest those up. So thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. 
Again, if you guys like this, don't forget the like button. And uh, if you're brand new to the channel, subscribe. Join us. Join this wonderful community of people. They make this place awesome. So check it out. Check us out on Discord, too, if you want to. We also have a bunch of servers up for some days to die right now. When Subsistence does come up, we will have it also multiplayer server as soon as we possibly can. But we have right now, testing out the Forest 1 server. We have Eco, and we have the 7 days to die server. So come join us on Discord. Thanks so much for being here. This is the Edge Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.